So as you can see, I did implement a function in the bot that will tell you if there is a card, an item whose lowest listed price is below the average. And if you've been around, you sure already know what this bot is. It's the Discord bot. I'll leave a link as always here on top of my face where I go over it. It's basically a bot that is available for free in the Discord whose link is down below in the description of this video if you want to join. I, again, it's joining the Discord is completely free and the Discord bot use it, utilizing the Discord bot itself is also absolutely free. And I implemented a function. So, so for now, what it could do, let me show you. It could plot, as you can see here, the number of a given item. For, for instance, this would be the Aspen VMAX Alt R from Fusion Strike. So it would give you the number of supply over time from the European market, this is car market data. And it would also give you the corresponding average price of the four lowest listing, as you can see here. In this specific example, it has been moving higher and then the medium price. I added a function which basically will tell you if there is an item which price is significantly lower and you yourself can decide how much lower you want to list it. So let me give you an example. Let's try to use the command ourselves. So we're going to need to add the exclamation point, which is everything is going to be explained in the Discord. There is a dedicated section where it's called bot command and then check price, which is the name of the command. And then we're going to need to add what item we wanted to, to check on. Let's do lost origin. So it's going to check for lost origin booster boxes. And then we're going to need to tell it a percentage. So if we type 10 and we click enter, it's going to see if the lowest lost origin box listed is 10% below the average price of the four lowest listing. So we're going to give it a second because it's the first query of the day for the first one. It's going to take more and you can see the lowest price at 180 is not more than 10% lower than the average of the four lowest prices. Now this is going to be an interesting tool because basically it's a deal finder and uh, there's two things I want to mention. I'll try to make this video as short as possible. So I don't want to waste too much of your time. Number one, as you can see, there is a version that will uh, basically tell you of all available sheets. So all available data. So all the products that I have listed in my spreadsheet, which is available for the command list. So if you type exclamation point list, it's going to tell you all the available product I have data for. And this list is basically growing larger every day because of the suggestion command where you can suggest anything you want. So because of this, basically, I can check for all these items without having to use the command check price every time. However, that is really time consuming for now. So what I want to I'm going to be working on is I'm going to be optimizing the code. I have a, a few ideas, but unfortunately, this is a very busy period for me because I have my Lex exam before I can graduate. I'm a mathematician if you if you're new to the channel. So I have my Lex exam in less than a month. So I'm really focused and I barely have time to make videos and work a bit on the bot. So that needs some code optimization and I'm going to try to do it. And uh, eventually I will make it available for you guys for free. So with just the command, you're going to be able to see if the European market, there is basically a listing available that is significantly lower than the average. And for instance, actually today there was one and it was the Magikar. Let me see if I can find it here. So where's the much card from Poldia Evolved? There you go. The filter price was 80. So it, it says filter price because I needed to update it. It would be the lowest listed price here. So the lowest listed price was 80. And uh, so this basically the data updates every once a day, usually around noon Central European time. And uh, by the time I look at 2 p.m., that listing at for 80 euros, which I lost again, uh, that listing here for a euro was gone. Same thing happened yesterday. Uh, there's I sent a message in the Discord where there was a Gengar VMAX Altar from Fusion Strike listed for 100, sorry, for 320 euros. Today, you could go check out the lowest listed in the European Union is 389. So as you can see, this thing works. And uh, again, for all of this, it needs optimization. So I don't want to lie to you. It is available. I just need to optimize it to make it as quick as possible. And one way you can help it is uh, obviously join the Discord, subscribe, 
leave a like if you enjoyed this video as if we are able to grow so if you also want to share this to your friends i'm also trying to work on a american version and there's going to be it's going to need time because it's a bit more complicated there so if we can grow larger the more we are, are the better I can work and the, the higher basically is a chance that I can also come up with a tool similar to this for all my subscribers and viewers in the American market. So that's going to be it for me today. This is available as you're watching video right now. So you can already use the check price command right now. And uh, again, hope you see you in the Discord. Hope you see you in the next video. And thanks for watching.